I sat down with Bob Means at Pine Grow where we discussed the ins and outs of various sticking points I had while streaming and learning Pine Grow. You can check those streams out on this channel and over at twitch.tv slash fake Sam Gregory. In this clip, we discuss as amateurs coding while streaming on Twitch. I'll be releasing the entire one and a half hour chat with Bob this Thursday. So make sure you're subscribed to that and hitting the bell notification so you're notified when the episode actually comes out. If you're new here, then my name is Samuel Gregory. And on this channel, we talk about all things front end and accessibility, including Webflow and Pine Grow. If that's the sort of thing you're in interested in then make sure you're subscribed and hit the bell notification so you're notified when new episodes come out. The easiest way to let me know that you like the content of this episode is to hit the like button and if you want to support me and my teachings then head on over to patreon.com slash fake Sam Gregory where you can support the channel for as little as five pounds a month. How, how are you I mean how are you finding coding and streaming um. um so i only stream right now to youtube um and i'm using you know just some software encoders mm -hmm. uh just what is it obs obs um, yeah, yeah, yeah and one other uh thing for handling audio and i try and keep everything you know kind of slim on the thing and it, it so far it seems to be working quite nicely and how, um, how do you find your your logical thinking though whilst developing knowing that you're either being watched yeah no 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 shame and no viewers but uh, vocalizing as you're yeah. typing and how, how are you finding all that yeah it's it's a little daunting i i have to admit you're a touch typer i'm not i stare at my fingers all the time um you know i i try if i force myself i can touch type but i quite often fall back just to, to staring at my fingers um, yeah, it, it is a little daunting and, uh, you know, I just, I, I throw it out there that, look, I'm going to have to Google some stuff. I'm going to have to go on stack overflow every so often. I'm going to have to drop back to the documentation I wrote, um, to, to know how to do some things and, you know, just be straight and up front. And it's, it's worked out pretty well. I, I, if I know what I'm doing, I, if I know the direction that I'm kind of going, I can usually speak pretty freely. I actually have more of a problem when I have a, a scripted uh, sort of presentation because my brain keeps going back to, ah, uh, did I want to say that next or that? I, I, have I covered I, everything? You know? Yeah, have I covered everything? Whereas when I'm just stream of consciousness, I can kind of babble along. Whether that's good viewing or not, I don't know. <laughs> Well, I think this is this is will answer those questions because, of course, yeah. like I was very comfortable kind of going into this, and we just we for those listening and whatever we decided to stream this five minutes before the well, actually, uh, we joined the call and I had <laughs> literally <laughs> press save to to be able to you know stream over Zoom, um, yeah. so we just decided off the cuff and it's fine. But um, what I'm finding is that I'm it's trickier for me to much better for, I. I probably should take a leaf out of your book and know the direction I'm going in because I sometimes just go, oh, I'm going to stream right now, which is probably not good for my viewership, but I'll decide if I want to stream and yeah. just whack something. I'll, I'll just decide what I'm going to do there. And then I should probably take a leaf out of your book and decide uh, what I'm doing because that might help me as I'm as I'm doing things, I, it, it, I find it harder to think about how to solve the problem. I don't mind yeah. Googling, that's fine. And, and, and I, think, I think some viewers will tune in specifically because they want to see a pro their process, the mistakes mm -hmm. that they make, you know, it's fine. Yeah. What I Google, you know, sometimes I Google yeah. very, very simple things like keywords or whatever, you know, mm -hmm. um, there's no shame in that whatsoever, but it's just, yeah. Um, problems I probably would be able to solve very, very quickly tend to take a little bit longer when I'm streaming. That's the only thing. Yeah. Yeah. That is probably very true for me as well. Yeah. Well, I mean, I mean, we're wrapping up now, but what is your, okay. what is your handle on the, um, on, on YouTube? I would suggest Twitch. I think that's becoming more of a platform, but you do you, the, but what is your handle? Yeah. So, so the, uh, only reason why I went for YouTube and this might be due to misinformation or under information on my part is that it seemed like Twitch streams uh, really were only sort of a limited time thing that 
they maintained those Twitch streams for, I don't know, 30 days or 15 days or something. And then those sort of went away. And, you know, the, the, I guess I didn't spend the uh, technical time to figure out, can I stream easily to both Twitch and YouTube where, you know, the YouTube was going to be saved long-term um, where I knew it was going to be saved long-term, you know, you, you, you kind of, uh, inadvertently you were, you were making a comment about, even if you're streaming to a small audience, you know, my, my biggest problem right now is, you know, any social media that I'm going out onto, I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm trying to do a service for the community, but you know, be truthful. My subscribership is, is really next to nothing because I, I haven't put the effort into try and grow it. You know, I haven't done the, you know, the wonderful job that you've done of putting splash screens at the beginning or, you know, doing that sort of thing. And, um, I, you know, it is what it is. Yeah. And you, and you sort of learn as you go, cause you've echoed so yeah. many similar thoughts that I have. I, I saw next to one of my first, uh, Twitch streams expires in three days. And I then checked in a few days and I said to my co-host on the podcast, I was like, we might want to think about Twitch cause I think videos expire, yeah. but it, I don't think it did. Um, okay. To your point though, you can then, it's very easy just to export to YouTube. So I'll probably just okay. export this to YouTube um, yeah, yeah, and yeah. then it's there hopefully forever. Um, I've not figured out how to stream to two different things at the same time. Um, I tried using OBS. This is like, you know, amateur, amateur streamer talk right now, <laughs> isn't it? We've got from Pine experts or experts in Pine Grove yeah. and dev to amateurism streaming. But yeah. we try to stream the podcast from Zoom into OBS and then up to Twitch or, or um, yeah. uh, YouTube. The, there was just such a lag in the thing, which is why we're streaming directly from Zoom to to twitch right now and, and i got a message from my co-host saying everything is fine um takes a bit of tweaking to get zoom to do that thing but if you're doing it on your own you haven't got that problem but right. the to, obviously with remote and two two people three well three people on a on a podcast uh yeah podcast yeah. we uh, we have to do it through zoom some way and i can do it directly through zoom but then i can't add the fancy graphics if i want to add the fancy graphics yeah. you know yeah, yeah, yeah. um but you know, uh, with with all this, you comes learning, and and once you get one thing sorted out, you can put that to rest, and then you can think, okay, what's the next thing I'm gonna change? Right, I'm gonna make my yeah. thumbnails a bit nicer. Just learn, yeah. develop, grow. Yeah, know, yeah. It's, cross cross it's fingers, bro. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, and and the only other thing I've realised with the with the Twitch stuff is just consistency, which is one thing that I I'm trying to work on, but. Uh, you know, I'm doing so much at the moment. It's hard to have that consistency with streaming, but you want to be able to say, Hey, I'm, I'm going to be online it's, tomorrow yeah. when next Wednesday, two weeks time, Wednesday, whatever it is. Yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you want to be able to say that and for people to be able to tune in, but yeah. I could be talking rubbish right now, but that's sort of what I'm <laughs> gathering. I only started streaming the last two weeks. So I'm all new to this yeah. anyway, but we'll figure it out. <laughs>